Welcome everyone, I'm Dita Press Dior, and this is Fantasy Maiden War Scarlet. Alright, I did some looking up. Well, in case people are going out of order in these parts, I've beaten the game with Reimu, and now we're going to probably do some, um, Marissa. But I wanted to go ahead and talk a bit about uh, what beating the game has done. Really not much, to be honest. I'm going to the options just to keep the music out of the way. But, um, there is no real new game plus from what I can tell. Also, um, while I, the only way you can actually kind of um, build up characters to 100% or anything is by using game overs. And if you use game overs, you will not be able to get WP points. So, uh, yeah, that's why if um, on the section where it says WP, bon uh, WP and then slash game overs, it, if you have any game overs at all, uh, it'll just show you your game overs and it'll have du zero, uh, zero WP points. Actually, that's redundant. Uh, w points. So, um, yeah. So there's not. This game's not really about grinding and building up the best character possible. Well, it's kind of like that way, but uh, you, it's working with what you've got. Anyway, um, also supposedly the um, if you keep the uh, the data files, which are you know in your folders and stuff of you beating this game with uh, Raymu and Marissa and stuff, supposedly you can transfer the. Uh, some of that data over to the next game, which is uh, Fantasy War uh, Mystic. Sorry about the background, my cat's playing with toys. But, um, yeah, supposedly it'll, it'll include things like transferring over a certain amount of points, grays, uh, grays points, and uh, skills. So that's kind of a neat little touch, but I don't know anything further about it, simply since the next part is still uh, in Japanese. Um, also, if you have a, a in your save data that you've beaten it as Sakia, which we haven't even unlocked yet, uh, you supposedly will get like some extra bonus thing in the uh, the next game. So that's about it. It's kind of a nice touch. I kind of wish there was some sort of new game plus, but that's all right. Uh, there are ways the uh, the cheat with the save data and make it so you have characters that you're not even supposed to have, like Aku and uh, and stuff like that. But I'm probably not going to mess with it. There's a, actually a lot of hidden data in the background of this game like characters that we don't even see at all but uh, I just wanted to talk about that there is no new game plus so I'm gonna be playing from scratch um, the other main thing is I'll be skipping through any dialogue that's a repeat also I'll be, and I'll also be skipping through any um, battles that I've, we've already seen before so this is gonna be a kind of a short run for you guys but it's gonna be a long run for me um, it'll be a little bit relaxing for me because I'll be able to at least play the, uh, the, 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 the levels you've already seen just on my own time and just quickly get them done without having to record them. So that's the plan. If I do notice there's a lot of different things, I'll just show everything. It's not that big of a deal. Alright. So that's our cue. Let's do this. Start game. I've played the first mission of Marissa's game uh, when I originally got this game. So I know a little bit about it. I know that the boss runs away, much to my dismay. But uh, we'll get this started. We'll set it on normal difficulty as usual. This start here is all repeated. I can speed through it like this, or if I press start, I can skip it entirely, which I'm, that's what I'm going to do. It's literally the same thing as the start in the Reimu story, so just read that if you want to. Do same thing, same thing. I think this is where it uh, starts new, so I'll just go ahead and read it. Okay, it looks like the cap have followed their orders and took shelter. All that's left is the village on the other side, and I need to hurry and finish patrolling. Hey, you patrol Tingu, what are you doing over here? You should be in the front on the front line. I've been assigned a different task. The Greater Tingu ordered me to confirm that no cap were wandering. What sort of capital would be out on th such a stormy night? Indeed, however, we cannot assume that everyone is so prudent. Actually, yes, we have read this before. My apologies. So, let's just skip through this. Now, we're going to see Nettery. Yeah, it's all repeat. So, no worries there. The next morning, Kinsoki became shrouded in Scarlet Mist. This is where stuff starts getting new. We now start in the Kirasami residence instead of um, the, the shrine. Uh, 
Oof, I slept too- I slept real long. I really burned that midnight oil researching magic yesterday. At least I finally finished the catalyst for my new magic. It ain't gonna be long now before people start calling me a great magician. And on that day, I'll become a magnificent hero known throughout Gensokyo. But in order to become that, I gotta deal with this scarlet mist first. It's been getting, thi uh, getting thicker and thicker since the storm that, that night. It's gotta be some sort of incident. It's only been a few days since the mist appeared. She's probably still lazing around at the shrine. So this is my chance to steal a march on her. Alright, it's been a while, but it's time to head out. Head on out. This is the first step of Magician Maris Marissa Kirisami's path to greatness. Force magic. Hmm, to eat or not to eat? That is the question. It's been so many days since I flew out from the mountain. I haven't eaten a real meal since then. I'm all out of cucumbers and I have no idea where I am. But this mushroom looks the least suspicious of all those I've seen. Smell, it kind of smells like a maitake uh, mushroom too. And if I collapse here, it ruins all that effort to slip out of the, of the mountain. I have to do this to return home safely and complete my invention. One, okay. One, two, wait! Ow! Phew, that was close. What was that for? Hey, give that mushroom back. You were really trying to eat this, huh? Give it up. This may look like a mataki mushroom, but it's actually real poisonous. Look closely, the tip has a faint purple tint to it, right? Real mataki mushrooms ain't ever that color. You're right, my empty stomach clouded my, ju my judgment. Thanks a lot, I didn't think I'd be saved by, by a human in a place like... Wait, a human? Whoa, don't suddenly shout like that. How could this be? I gotta hide. Um, let's see. What's wrong? Is there something real scary behind me? My optical camouflage is out of order. A river. There's none around. Shut up! Ruff. How's my broomstick, broomstick taste? Oh, painful. What are you stuffing in other people's mouths? That's because... Oh, sorry. That's because you looked like you were gonna leg it. So what if I'm human? Oh, maybe you've got something to do with this scarlet mist. What are you talking about? I mean, there's lots of mist here. But I'm just lost, that's all. Don't act dumb, you tried to run from me. That ha means you have to be involved. Uh, it, er, I was trying to run away, but it's just... It's been a long time since I've seen a human that I didn't know beforehand. They're talking pretty normally to uh, said human right now, though. Aha, you're right. I'm Derek uh, Kawashiro Akapa. Nice to meet you. I'm Marissa Kirisami, a magician. You're Akapa, huh? I thought you guys don't come out much from Yokai Mountain. You want to stay hidden or something? Yep, yep. We don't see many humans in the mountain either. That's why you scared me. So if you're supposed to be at the mountain normally, what you're doing here now? There's somewhere I needed to go, and it's been a long, uh, it's been a long since I've descended from the mountain. So I ended up losing my bearings and. <laughs> Taking a walk alone in this forest is a pretty tall hurdle for a beginner. It really is. My optical camouflage bro broke down. I got a broomstick stuffed down my throat by a weird human. It's been bad. It's pretty much all your own fault, though. Oh yeah, you Kappa always carry cool, uh, are always carrying cool inventions around, aren't you? Got anything weird on you right now? Hmm, I do, but they're at the mountain. Oh, so I can take a look if I go to the mountain? I'll pay you a visit there next time. Uh, you can't. Why not? I don't care if it's messy. That's not it. Humans are in trouble. Are in trouble. Of, or sorry, are in for trouble if they enter Yokai Mountain. And there's already some fuss happening there now. I think. Hmm. Something's happening at Yokai Mountain. Uh, uh. Never mind that. Anyway, there's some place I really need to get to right now. Ah, uh, right. You said something like that. Yeah, I was looking for an item item shop called Corindo. Do you happen to know where it, that is? I read from a newspaper that it carries items and magic from the outside world. Corindo, eh? There's definitely lots of weird things there. Huh, you know about it. Know about it? I'm a special customer. I'll bring you there. Really? Thank goodness. I thought Haley's Comet would uh, come again before I found that shop. Uh, do you have the time for that, though? If you're busy, then... Well, well, I sort of am. I'm trying to figure out where all this mist is coming from. But I was heading there to do something else first anyways. I asked Corindo's shopkeeper to make some adjustments to something for me. I think it's going to be helpful for the investigation if it's ready. I see. I'll be relying on your guidance, uh, f on you for guidance, then, Marissa. Gotcha. Follow me closely. Force magic. Please wait, Aya. Momiji, why are you being so slow? I can wait. I can wait, but all the exclusive stories won't. I'm not being particularly slow. Your tendency to fly ahead is taxing the limits of my ability. Seeing over long distances only takes you so far. 
Don't be so worthless. We need to hurry and find that shrine maiden and, and write an article about her. Our responsibility is to watch out for her, not to write an article about her. Yokai Mountain has been infiltrated at its core. You should be exhibiting professionalism about your responsibilities. No, no, it's the other way around, Moemiji. If you think like that, it, you'll never get promoted. The motto of us yokai is to always have fun and laughter, no matter the situation. This is the first major incident since the Oni left. In other words, the first major incident since the Tingo Society has been formed. Is that what the, uh, is that what it's all about? Well, I have, I had not heard of two people putting up such a large fight before this. That's not very strange. Our opponents are gods, after all. The problem is that is the problem is that shrine maiden. She's been prowling around the outside the mountain. Our, her objectives need to be confirmed. Yes, that is our our current duty, and a story regarding that matter. That will surely make me the champion of this year's newspaper tournament. So it is all for that, after all. Reporting on the matters regarding this affair to the outside is, is prohibited. Would you be fine in that regard? Eh, that, is that true? The Greater Tingu no, uh, notified everyone already. You, we are to prevent anyone from leaking information outside the mountain. No way, the suppression of freedom of speech is unforgivable. With the martial law that we are currently undergoing, that does not matter. That's true, but uh, I feel all my motivation fading away, fading away now. This is our duty, so please carry it out properly. You're quite the obedient dog, aren't you? I'm a wolf, good grief. Please take your work more seriously. Hmm, what is this? What's up, did you find the Shrine Maiden? No, not the Shrine Maiden. However, a human and a kappa are flying a little ahead of us. And that kappa, could it be? A human and a kappa. That's strange. If martial law has been declared, then the kappa shouldn't be leaving the mountain. That is correct, and a kappa being with a, a human is, e is even stranger. Let's ask them some questions. They might know the something about the Shrine Maiden. And even if they don't, it's definitely an interesting pairing. Understood. Please keep uh, going in this direction. Nittery, what are you doing here? Alright. First combat as Marissa. As you probably can guess, we start out with Marissa and Nittery right off the bat. Hey, are we at Car uh, Corindo yet? Don't get so impatient. We're almost there. But I've been looking forward to this ever since I left the mountain. Oh yeah, you never told me why you wanted to go to Corindo. My current intervention needs some special parts, so I figured I'd search for them at an item shop. If they have what I want in stock, then my invention is complete, and the thought of it excites me too much to calm down. I know how that feels. You always want to borrow things that you want. Borrow? Um, right. Hmm, who's that? Eck, don't tell me. I would not believe it if I did not see it with my own eyes, but it really is you, Nettery. Momiji, what, why are you here? That is what I want to ask. What are you doing here during such a major event? You are aware that the entire mountain is in a state of martial law now. The capital are currently prohibited from leaving the mountain. Eh, martial law? What the? So when did uh, when you said you couldn't return to the mountain? No, no, it's true I didn't get permission before leaving, but I didn't know the situation had gotten so serious. Uh, my, Momiji, do you know her? Yes, yeah, she is a friend of mine, Dedori Kawashiro. I have no idea what she is doing here, though. I was not even aware she had left the mountain. Who are who are you all anyway? You all seem to be in a rush, just like Nettery. Ah yes, you would be the ordinary uh, human magician that resides in this forest. Yep, yep, I'm the great human magician that resides in this forest. Oh ho, so even the yokai finally know my name. Um, know my name now. I don't know your name, but I do believe I saw you before at a previous incident. A kappa running away from the mountain and a human who lives in the forest. The two having a secret meeting. It sounds like it'd be good make uh, for a good article. Hmm, an article. What do you mean? Ah, I should have mentioned. I am Aya Shama. Sorry, Shamari Maru, a reporter in a Crow Tingu. I am uh, the compiler of the Bun Bun Baro. Sorry, Bun Bun Maru uh, newspaper. It's the fastest and most fantastic fountain of truth in Katsokyo. Hmm, such good pictures. We're not meeting secretly or anything, I just happened to run into Majorissa. Right, and if you want an article, there's lots more interesting things to cover. Oh, such as, I would love to hear about it. Such as this scarlet mist all over, you can see it as you fly, can't you? Ah, aha, I see. That is an important incident, too. That is an important incident, too. Ah, yeah, yeah, that was a dangerous choice of words. 
Well, whatever. I'll be settling this missed incident from here on. If you want a prior interview, now's your chance. Hmm, I did indeed forget about this missed incident. Momiji, I'll be heading to the skies to take photos of the mist. Eh? Are you planning to ignore our orders to look out for the Shrine Maiden? That isn't for me. You can find, your, find her yourself. It's a responsibility more suited for you anyway. Such selfishness. I'll be counting on you. And I leave. This always happens when I'm paired with her. Looks like she wants this matter to be concluded without needing an article. I'm sure she overlooked it as a friend of mine, uh, a friend of mine was, was involved. Now then, let's return to the mountain nittery. As I said earlier, martial law has been declared. Oh, well, hold it. What do you mean just now? You said you were looking out for the Shrine Maiden earlier, didn't you? What did uh, Ramu do this time? You certainly have sharp ears for a human. Ah, oh, that's right, Nettery. Uh, Nettery, have you seen any suspicious Shrine Maidens around? Specifically a Shrine Maiden that is not the Hakari Shrine Maiden. I haven't seen any Shrine Maidens. I've been lost and alone, tr wandering the force of magic the whole time. That is what you get for flying off by yourself. Well, it is no matter if you do not know. Finding her is my duty anyway. That is all I wanted to ask. Come, Nettery. Wait, don't just end the conversation like that. There's a Shrine Maiden that ain't Reimu? I have no idea what you're on about. Does it have something to do with the Scarlet Mist? I will not answer your questions. If you wish to interf uh, interfere any further, I will have to get rid of you by force. Come, everyone. Ha, huh, if it's a Damako uh, battle you want, that's exactly what you're get gonna get. Nettery, you know about Damako battles, right? I'm quite informed on them. Why? Why? You're obvious You're gonna be helping me out, obviously. Eh? Why must I fight Momiji? If I get shot down here, you can't go to Corindo. Are you okay with that? Hmm. But I said... How tiresome. I shall sign both of you. Haha, <laughs> just try it. This isn't sp how it's supposed to be. Bah, desperate times call calls for desperate measures. Alright, objective, defeat all enemies. Bonus objective, defeat Momiji last. Now, I, I played through this to the point where I, I did try to defeat Momiji last, and he, she, sorry, ended up running away. So it's one of those fights where I have to deal with running away. Now, first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to save and hope it doesn't crash or anything. Okay, that seems to work. Okay, now, just to review what we have. We actually start out with an item. Nettery starts out with Genjo Saki, which is a healing item. Because uh, we don't exactly have a healer, so... That's something to note. Um, we, same stuff, support, attack, uh, support attack, support defense. And uh, Marissa starts out with um, Magician level 1 and gain. He, she doesn't know Excel yet. So, how much spirit do you have? Okay, you have enough to do two, um, two, two um, gains, so we'll make use of those. So, as always, we're just going to move together. in their turn. And I get support from Nettery. Awesome. I'm glad I've moved to that position. Also, I didn't realize, but looking through the manual, if you if you kill something while in uh, unfocused mode, you will actually get a bonus, a bonus amount of experience. It's about only 10%, but it's better than nothing. Damn, one-shotted. Unlike the first mission in Remu, um, this isn't timed. I'll let Nettery take the hits. That's completely fine by me. I didn't really take advantage of support, attack, or defense the first time I did this. And now that I know how it works... Hardly a problem. Oh, here comes the Damaku. Marissa, it'll be dangerous if you fly into the Damaku unfocused like that. You can avoid the Damaku if you switch to focus movement. Focus movement? That's too troublesome. The Damaku will disappear if you if we just beat the fairies up after all. What will you do if you get hit? If you go into focus movement, you'll only take uh you'll only take minor damage. It uses up a bit of MP, but it's effective when da the Damaku is thick. Okay, okay, I'll be careful. So there you go. Brief tutorial stuff. This Damaku is not really that big of a deal. 
your movement. Okay. Actually, what's your movement again? One, two, three, four, five. So, one, two, three, four, five, maybe. One way to find out. Do which ley line? Actually, what level are you? Level six. Okay, let's make use of it. We'll do spirit gain. Move you up here. Still didn't level. Wow. Takes a while, doesn't it? And we'll just do extending arm. There we go. This attack will hurt a little bit more because I have uh, minus defense. It's minus 5%, it's not that big of a deal. Hmm. Yeah, go for it, Nettery. You'll be fine. Hopefully. <laughs> Might as well move there while I'm on the ground. As for you, ground. There we go. Now we actually have some evasion. Not that it's helping that much, but it's giving me a little bit of defense, I think. No counter, huh? Oh, I have to be in the air to use that. Okay. I'll just evade. Player aim bullets and monster king but cumber. Okay. I don't have to use Genjo Saki already. How oh, good you dodged it. How strong is your attack? Yeah, we'll hold off. Probably should have attacked with Marissa first, but I don't think Marissa can actually miss at this point. Oh, 
This video might go a little long. Actually, what I'll probably do is make a save just before I finish this level. So I can uh, split it a little bit. Okay, let's take to the air. You're practically dead, so I'm just gonna use Illusion Laser. I won't get support because uh, Nettery's on the ground and I'm in the air. That's okay. We'll do a uh, narrow spark. Yeah, leveled up. Alright. Take the air. Go ahead and use scan. We've already seen this character before, it's just gonna be a weaker version. 6000 HP, okay. Shield defense, parry. Wow, that's so many abilities. And she does have a 5 range attack. Five. Yep. Go ahead and guard. And we'll wait there. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and save the game. And I'm gonna go ahead and call this a video. I'm the Depressed Hero. This was Fantasy Made More Scarlet. Remember, I said playthrough. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time.